how to respond to weakening global growth and the political and economic implications if Britain were to leave the European Union are the two big talking points for financial leaders from the world's 20 biggest economies meeting in Shanghai. Britain's George Osborne is lobbying for his counterparts to speak out against a Brexit. It was one of the topics when he met with China's Vice Premier Ma Kai. The Chinese Foreign Ministry spokesman was very diplomatic. He said, we're always in support of the European integration process and we're willing to see the EU play a bigger role internationally. We also hope Britain and the EU can appropriately handle the relevant issue. The International Monetary Fund's Christine Lagarde was more direct. She has already said that Britain leaving the EU would be negative on all fronts, and she expanded on those comments in Shanghai. Because there is uncertainty as to what the terms would be under which the UK would be out of the European Union, uh, it's difficult to assess exactly the consequences of it, but most likely it will be less fluid and not more fluid. We are bound to conclude without having yet done the study, and we will try to do as, as fair and thorough a study as we can, that it, it, it will be a negative if it was to succeed. But there will be no G20 backing for the IMF's idea of coordinated stimulus to boost the global economy. Germany's Finance Minister Wolfgang Schäuble and US Treasury Secretary Jack Lew have dismissed that.